Today we're going to be trying on dresses from Lulu. And if you're interested to see what they look like on a curvy body, stay tuned. Alright, they asking for the queen. Hey, what's up you guys? My name is Elente. And if you don't know, now you know. Now let's get straight into this clothing haul. By the way, these are all like cocktail dresses. First up, I have this royal blue A-line type skirt um dress so it has the crosses in the back and everything like that as you can see in the video next to me but this dress it fits good below the waist if that makes sense so the upper part of it is quite big for me um i'm like a 36d maybe double d i can't remember but they're not my real boobs so i'm not worried about it <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, I have nursing boobs right now. So they're like 36 double D or something like that. I can't remember, but I want to say that's what it was. 36 D, 36 double D, one of those. However, back to what I'm talking about. I got the dress in the extra large. I got all these dresses in extra large. So yeah, this royal blue dress, it has the A-line at the bottom. So you don't really have to worry about wearing shapewear or anything in it. For me though, since my butt sits up kind of high, I had issues with it being like an asymmetric. If you look from the side, it hangs low in the front and higher in the back. It's kind of been like that since I was a kid. So, you know, I don't look at that too much but it definitely detours me from buying i thought this dress was cute however i would have to get the straps taken in for me so they could be tighter because they're very loose and i don't think you could wear a bra with this you would have to figure out how to do boob tape or something with it yeah but it fit me i didn't have any troubles getting in it at all uh it has a zipper on the back of the skirt part of the dress yeah cute let's move on to the next one next up i have this sparkly glittery purple dress um i thought that this dress looked cute on me the, it does have a lining underneath it so you might have an issue with having to pull it down underneath the bottom part of the dress fit me very snug the top part of the dress again was kind of loose and then the straps are not adjustable on it, it they are like stretchy like a rubber band kind of not like not a rubber band but elastic there we go but they are like very spaghetti strap ish so you would definitely need if you have heavy boobs you're gonna need <laughs> You're gonna need a um, strapless bra for that or boob tape again. Oh, it also has darting down the front of the dress. I like this dress. It fit me good and I felt like it looked good. The glittery stuff on it is kind of scratchy. So you'll probably, if you rub up against somebody, I'm sure you would give them rug burn or something <laughs> on them. But uh, if you rub too hard, not like that or anything, but yeah. So that's something to think about. This dress was cute, very short though. Let's move on to the next one. Next, I have this green dress, OMG. Like for real, this dress is so cute to me. I don't know if it's because it's green and you know, they got us obsessed with green since last year. <laughs> I have so many green items. I don't think I've ever bought green this much in my life. However, green is looking bomb. I mean, everything looks bomb on the melanin, but this looks bomb on me. I would wanna wear a little bit of shapewear around my belly area, but outside of that, it looks good. But when I ordered these online, I thought that they were the same dress, the purple one and the green one. Clearly they're not. <laughs> outside of how the straps are hooked up, this one has the asymmetric neckline as the purple one did not, you know, it was just straight across two straps. This one has asymmetric, which made the dress way better to me. I don't know why. And it doesn't have the darting down the front like the purple one does, which I thought the darting would help you look slimmer. But to me, I look better in this green one. So I don't know. I really like the green one. But like I said, I would need to wear something smoothing to smooth out my love handles a little bit. I really like this dress. It's really cute. However, the bottom part is way tighter than the purple one. So that's my issue with this one. It also has the black line, satin lining on the inside, but it's not that kind of lining that if you get the dress in extra large, the lining is size medium. It's not that kind of lining. It actually stretches with the dress, but basically this one fit tighter in the hip area. I don't know if it's because it might be shorter. I don't even think it's shorter. I don't know. But anyways, the hip area fit tighter to me in this green one in comparison in the purple one. So that's the only thing I don't like about it because it makes the split on the leg on the it makes the split on the thigh too wide so it looks like you're stretching the dress out and it's too small so I'm not in the business of wearing clothes that look too small or are too small so that's why I don't like this dress but outside of that everything is cute so if you don't have huge hips I would say get this dress if you have brown skin get this dress <laughs> um it's super cute i love the asymmetric neckline that it has on and it's not as scratchy as the purple one it is scratchy but it's not as scratchy so I'm, i don't know if it's different glitter or what but yeah the tops oh 
and the bra area again is quite loose for me so i would have to get some type of adjustment done eh, i might be okay if i just get some boob tape it won't be that big of an issue of anything but mm, the straps i feel like need to be adjustable Moving on. Next, I have this blue satin dress. This dress is short. However, it's not as short as the previous two that I tried on. It's a pretty good length. However, oh, and the satin stretch is re really good. I was surprised about that. Like it's super stretchy satin material. It has that tulip shaped skirt on it, which I thought would be good for me due to the fact that I have this fat stomach stuff going on and it's good to hide it. It was cute, not as cute as I was thinking it was gonna be. And I don't like the fact that my nipples show through the satin, but it is what it is. I would have to get nipple covers. And again, straps that don't adjust. So I would need that fixed on them. All in all, it's cute if you don't have big hips like I do, because every time I walk and I show you in the video that I am walking back and forth and it's getting higher and higher and higher, next thing you know, your underwear or your vagina is out however you like to wear your clothes. <laughs> and yeah, we don't wanna have our vaginas out when we're out here trying to look cute in our cocktail dresses. So yeah, um, not my favorite dress out of the bunch, with, but was my favorite dress that I chose when I was looking online. That's crazy, right? So the shape of it is cute. If you have cellulite, as you can see in my booty, cellulite showing all day long through that. So <laughs> you wanna be aware of that. And yeah, cute dress. Make sure you don't have to worry about your hips pulling the dress up. All right, we're already on our second to last item. This black dress with like the nude, with like a mesh with the nude underneath. I really liked it on me. However, I wish there was options to pick what color nude you could wear underneath. Cause yes, it's nude underneath, but it's not my nude. I really like it. The ruching, anything with ruching to me, always is good because it covers up imperfections that's it like yes i have a gut but can you really tell with this ruching you can't yes i have um muffin top can you really tell with the ruching no you can't so yeah i like the dress i don't care for the undertone of the dress it was very and then also one thing it was very hard for me to zip <laughs> So you will need assistance getting in and getting out. And also with that one, you can wear a regular bra. You don't have to worry about boob tape or anything because the straps are normal, fixed um, tank top type straps. And you can adjust the ruching on the front side. I think I showed you that a little bit, but to me it looked best when I just pulled it on and it set where it needed to sit. Me adjusting it, I feel like it made some areas more noticeable because it put all the ruching in one spot instead of having it you know, spread out across the body. Outside of that, good dress. Yeah, I liked it. All right, drum roll please, because we are on the last dress. We are on the last dress. We are on the last dress. No, let me stop. So yeah, we're on the last dress, this all black dress with the little peep hole in the front. And it has the lovely kind of split that I love. I love a high split with the thigh showing. But the way this dress is made, it was really, really hard for me to zip. I had a really hard time zipping this dress alone. There's no way for me to really put my boobs in this dress. So I'm always gonna have some type of under boob going on. I can't put a bra because then that's gonna show underneath. You could put boob tape, but I'm still gonna have under boob. So that's my thing with it. So I feel like this is more for a smaller chested person. I'm not saying my boobs are big or anything, I'm just saying. If I had my old boobs, they probably would fit in here. <sighs> I miss those barely cups that I had B cups for people who are like barely cups. Yeah, anyway, so yeah, if you have smaller boobs, I think this will look great on you. And if you had less hippage, because the dress rises up as you walk, again, for uh, too much hips, this dress is perfect for you. So check out Lulu's because clearly their shit is the shit. <laughs> I haven't bought anything yet from Lulu's, even though I've only shopped on there three or four times, that I just be like, what are they doing with this? What? Yes, they're for smaller sized people. So, you know, I have to play it by ear on stuff. But all in all, their stuff is very, very cute. Like, cute. So yeah, go out, get one of these dresses. If not two of these dresses, you're gonna need it. <laughs> um, I had got these for, 
a bachelorette weekend that I was a part of. However, they didn't get to me in time. Not Lulu's fault. My fault for ordering the week that I'm flying out. Anyways, and then not putting express shipping. What was I thinking? This concludes the video. Make sure you leave me a comment on which dress you think looks best on me. And let me know which ones you're about to buy. Because I know you're about to buy something. Because these dresses are bomb. Um... <laughs> Uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share this video with your friends and family. And until next time. I dance on that demon time. She might start her only fans. Big B and that B stand for bands. If you want to see some real ass, baby, here's your chance. I say left cheek, right cheek, drop a load of swine.